Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from what we have here. And what is given, which is 8 raised to the power x equals to 48. Here, we take the log on both sides. Then we have log 8 raised to the power x equals to log 48 on this side. Then here we apply the power law of logarithm from where we have log m raised to power p, which is the same thing as p log m. Then what we have here becomes x log 8 equals to log 48 on this side. That is, next step we divide both sides by log 8, divide here by log 8, then also divide this side by log 8, which implies log 8 cancels each other here. And what we have becomes x equals to log 48 over log 8. Then next step from here, we can reduce this and we write 48 as 8 times 6. Then what we have becomes x equals to log 8 times 6 then over log 8 from here then from the law of logarithm when we have log a times b the same thing as log a plus log b that is here what we have becomes x equals to log 8 plus log 6 over log 8. Then we can separate this into two fractions from where we have a plus b over c, which can be written as a over c plus b over c. Then here we have x equals to log 8 over log 8, then plus log 6 over log Eight. Then here log eight can switch other. We have one left here. Then we have x equals to one plus log six over log eight. Then also from here we can reduce this further since six here same thing as two times three, and eight here same thing as two times two times two which is 2 raised to power 3. Then what we have here becomes x equals to 1 plus log into bracket 2 times 3 here. Then over log 2 raised to power 3 from here. Then when we apply the law of logarithm here, also from log a times b, which is same thing as log a plus log b then what we have here becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 plus log 3 then over here as well on the power law which is when we have log m raised to power p which is equals to p log m then here this becomes 2 3 log 2 from here then which implies here we can also separate this fraction into two and we have x equals to one plus log two over three log two then plus log three over three log two that is from here we have log two cancel each other here so we are left with 1 over 3 here. So we have x equals to 1 plus 1 over 3, then plus. Here we can write this as 1 over 3 times log 3 over log 2. That is, from what we have here, applying the change of base, when we have log a over log b, this same thing as log a, to base B. 
that is here we have this become x equals to 1 plus 1 over 3 here that's same thing as 4 over 3 then plus here we have 1 over 3 log 3 base 2 and uh, we can write it in another way as x equals to 4 plus log 3 base 2 then over 3 so here we have the solution to this given problem as x equals to 4 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 then we can check to confirm if this will satisfy the given problem from what we have here we substitute the value of x which is x equals to 4 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 here yeah? then what we have becomes 8 raised to power 4 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 is equals to 48 on this side then here we can rewrite it as 2 raised to power 3 then multiply by 4 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 here yeah? is equals to 48 from what we have here then since this power multiplies 3 cancel each other and this remains 2 raised to power 4 plus log 3 base 2 is equals to 48 on this side that is here from the law of indices a raised to power m plus n this is same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n which implies here we have 2 raised to power 4 times 2 raised to power log 3 base 2 and is equal to 48 on this side then 2 raised to power 4 here, 2 multiplied say 4 times, that's 16, then times here, this follows from a raised to power log b base a, which is same thing as b. That is, what we have here is same thing as 3, and is equal to 48 from here. Then, 16 times 3 here is 48, which is equal to 48. Now, we have the left hand side equals to the right hand side. Hence, from here, we conclude that x equals to 4 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to step, subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up. See you next class and bye for now.